In this video, I will show you how to set up a data logging system using our i7000 module. So right now, I have a i7065 module hooked up to my computer. So i7065 is a four-channel digital input and five channels relay output module. This is a data sheet of it to explain which the specification of the module. So first of all, once you connected this module to my computer, then I can go to the DCON utility, which is the configuration utility for I7000 and M7000 series. So I need to connect, uh, specify which COM port is already using on my computer, and the bug ray, protocol, checksum, and data format. So once I find the module, I can double click on it and see the specification. So I can configure the protocol, address, bug ray, priority checksum in this page. Also, I can control the digital output in real time by just checking the which channel and monitor the DI status from here. Once all the configuration is done, I can exit out from DCON utility and go to my Easy Data Logger software. In Easy Data Logger software, I can go to my group setup, install the driver, which is a DCON driver, because I7065 is a DCON module. But there are also other protocols you can select, such as uh, Mobus Serial, which is Mobus T uh, RTU, Mobus TCP. So in this case, I will select DCON as a protocol. COM port is 11 on my computer for grade 9600 and click install. Next step will be adding the device on Easy Data Logger software. So depending on the which series you're using, you can, in this case, I will be using 7000 so I can find the 7065 here. So the number of channels is already entered. And then click Add and Close. I will see there's nothing on AI and AO, which makes sense because this module doesn't have AI and AO channels. But if you go to DI and DO, you will see the built-in channels here. What I need to do is select all the channels, click Add, and select DO and Add. So my work group one will have those four channels of DI and five channels of DDO. I'm going to go back to home. And I can start to see if it's running or not. Okay. When you see this on light on the device state page, that means the module is working and communicating with my easy data logger software. I can go to layout and turn on or off the digital output, or just monitor the status of digital input. So if you're using other module, for example, like I-7017, which has uh, analog input, that will also show up here. And I can go to gauge and train. So this is a trend page. I can actually control 
my digital output here. So turn on the relay, and it will show it show up on the train. So in order to log the data into my computer, I can just let me stop the it first, and I go to system config. So this is how you need to configure the data logging um, feature. So I can either log the data into my local database, which is it can be Excel or text file, SQL Server, or my SQL database. So after I check the log local database and set the recall time and the data the saving path and click save. Every time you start the project, the data will be logged into this computer. Once it's finished logging, I can go to database, click the open database button, and find the database you just logged it. And I can find the random one and then click low table, you will see it has uh, all the data is time stamped. And each, it will show the number of uh, data points and which channel is referring to. Again, low, click low train. It will show up the train we just logged it. Or I can select export to export the data log into Excel format or text file format. This is how you set up the data logging in Easy Data Logger if using our I7000 module, M7000, or ET7000 module.